All right, good day everyone. My name is Uchen Namdi. Uh, today we are going to quickly look at the uh, Cambridge Assessment International Education, um, um, that is the IGCSE uh, for Information and Communication Technology. Uh, that's the code right there, 0417, paper 02. Okay, so um, it has uh, document production, data man manipulation, and presentation. But quickly for this video, we will uh, look at uh, task 1 and 2. Task 1 has to do with um, the evidence document, and then task 2 has to do with uh, document, that's document production. So we'll quickly look, look at it and um, so that the video can be short enough, uh, and then we'll continue uh, in the next uh, video. All right, so thank you. All right, so we're, say, we're told to open uh, the file n to 119 evidence.rtf. So uh, you go to your source folder, you're supposed to find that uh, evidence there. Okay, right there. All right, so I've opened my thing. Okay, this is what it looks like. So that's where you put all of the evidences and then the steps are included. So step one, step two, evidence one, evidence two. So you won't get confused at all. Okay, moving forward, make sure that your name, center number and candidate number will appear on every page of this document. Your name, candidate number, center number. So quickly you come over here, um, you go to insert and then um, you go to where well, they didn't specify exactly where it should appear so i think at this point you're free to make it appear anywhere i would choose the header okay the name candidate number center number all right so you can either decide to choose any of this um however they didn't specify well uh, um if they should be splitted it should be columns or so so i'll just speak this okay i put my name um, my name, mm, and I put comma, center number, or, or, um, any number chosen, candidate number zero, zero, 001. Okay, so I don't think I need this, so I'll take it out. I don't need this, I'll take it out. All right, so let's go back to the question and see. Okay. Um, make sure that your name, and number, okay, we've done that. Save this evidence document in your work area as evidence followed by your candidate number, for example. Da, 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 da. Okay, so um, we're not told what format to save it. You will need to place on this evidence. So we're not told exactly what format. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so we're not told exactly what format to use. Okay, so uh, so what's left is to save, uh, of course, with your center number. All right, so I'm going to go into savers and then change the file name. So this the file where oh, the folder where I keep them. Where, I keep, where where the evidence I kept. So so I'll just add zero zero one as um part of the word. Now usually. You would uh, save this in the format of the document, okay? So they didn't specify, so I can choose to. I choose to. All right, and then I'll say save. Okay, your document will be upgraded to the newest file format because I moved from RTF to uh, DOCX, okay, to old format. All right, moving forward now. Okay, so what do we have? Make sure that your name, okay, we're through with that, sorry, sorry. 